हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय सेल्फ डॉक्टर सचिन सरोदे आई वेलकम ऑल ऑफ यू इन लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव लर्न डेफिनेशन एंड एग्जांपल ऑफ साइक्लिक ग्रुप इन दिस वीडियो वी विल लर्न सम एलिमेंट्री प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ साइक्लिक ग्रुप वी लर्न दिस रिजल्ट फर्स्टली थेरम एवरी साइक्लिक ग्रुप इज अबिलियन ग्रुप इफ यू हैव टेकन एनी साइक्लिक ग्रुप देन इट इज अबिलियन ग्रुप सो we will see the proof let g star be a cyclic group and let a be a generator of g so that g is a group is equal to subgroup generated by a and this is a set a raised to n such that n belongs to z set of all integers so consider g1 and g2 be any two elements of g so that g1 is equal to a raised to r and g2 is equal to a raised to s for some integers r and s now consider g1 star g2 is equal to g1 is what a raised to r and what is g2 a raised to s therefore g1 star g2 is what a raised to r star a raised to s what is a raised to r a star a how many times r times a raised to s means what a star a how many times s times therefore a is to r star a is to s is what a star a how many times r plus s times that is what a is to r plus s we can write a is to r plus s as a a is to s plus r now here a is to s plus r means what a is a star a how many times s plus r times so we can write it as a a is to s star a is to r And what is a raised to s? G two star a raised to r is what? G one. Therefore, G one star G two is equal to G two star G one. And so, by definition of abelian group, G is a abelian. See here, converse of this result is need not be true. Means we have example of a abelian group which is not a cyclic group. Example is V Kellin four group. Kellin four group is a abelian group but v is not a cyclic group now we will learn a result a subgroup of a cyclic group is cyclic what this theorem says if we have a cyclic group g and if we take any subgroup h of g then h is also a cyclic group we will see the proof of this result uh, this result let g star be a cyclic group and let a is a generator of g that is g is a group which is generated by a and let h be any subgroup of g we have to show h is also cyclic then we have two cases one case first case if h is equal to singleton e then clearly h is cyclic group and it is generated by e if h is not equal to singleton e then we must have a raised to n belongs to h for some positive integer n let m be the smallest positive integer such that a raised to m is in h we claim that a raised to m generates h that is h is equal to subgroup generated by a raised to m we must show that every element b is in h is a power of a raised to m since b is in h and h is a subgroup of g therefore b must be in g and we have no g is a cyclic group and it is generated by a therefore b is equal to a raised to n for some n belongs to z by division algorithm we will find q and r such that n equal to m q plus r where r is greater than or equal to 0 and strictly less than m for more details of division algorithm you can see the video well ordering principle and division algorithm link of video is given in description so what we have by division algorithm n is equal to mq plus r now what we have 
b is equal to a raised to n. Therefore, b equal to a raised to n is equal to a raised to m q plus r. We have just put the value of n. What is n? n is equal to m q plus r. a raised to m q plus r. We can write this as a a raised to m bracket raised to q into a raised to r. From this, we can find the value of a raised to r. We will take a raised to m raised to q to the left hand side. Therefore, we will have a raised to r is equal to a raised to m bracket raised to minus q into a raised to n. a raised to n and a raised to m is in h and h is a group. Therefore, a raised to m bracket raised to minus q and a raised to n are in h. Thus, a raised to m raised to minus q into a raised to n is in h. That is a raised to r in h. See here, a raised to m raised to minus q into a raised to n is what? a raised to r. So, we got a raised to r in h. Now, see what, what is the value of r? r is greater than or equal to 0 and strictly less than m. Already we have taken m to be the smallest positive integer such that a raised to m is in h and we are got we are getting a raised to r is in h but r is strictly less than m. We are getting contradiction therefore r must be a 0. Since m is the smallest positive integer such that a raised to m is in h and r is greater than or equal to 0 strictly less than m we must have r equal to 0. When r, then we get got the r is equal to 0, therefore n is equal to m cube. So here, put the value of r as a 0, we will get n is equal to m cube. And therefore, b is equal to a raised to n. Just put the value of n, we will get a raised to m cube. And a raised to m cube can be written as a raised to m whole raised to q. That is, b can be written as a power of a raised to m. Therefore, every element of h can be written as a power of a raised to m. Therefore, a raised to m generates h and hence h is a cyclic group. Thank you.